Hello everybody, my name is Jad, welcome to another MLB 9 Index 22 video, and in today's video, we've got a lot of packs to go through, we've got skill changes to go through. This is actually really strange that this is probably going to be one of the least exciting videos I post recently, because we're kind of in a middle ground here right now. So like, last video we had like the Legend Pack and Dole Team Select Sig and all that stuff, but like, I don't have that much stuff right now. Like, this is kind of like a boring time. Like, I just got packs, and I just got combos and skill changes. So, I mean, like, like here, I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Also, last video, I totally forgot. We have a SIG combo to do, too. Like, this just completely went over my head. I, I realized as soon as I finished recording, I'm like, all right, you know what? I forgot about this, but I apologize. I figured we'd do it this week. But, um, but like, here's what I'm talking about. So... Right now, what we're working on is we're trying to get Edgar Martinez, the legend we pulled last video. We're trying to get him in the lineup. Problem is, is I only have 172 black diamond pieces right now, which means I can't take in a black diamond, which means I don't want to use the premium skill changes I have here because I want to use them when I get into black diamond next week. So that way, maybe we can get him into the lineup. So uh, no BD, no BD upgrade this week. I don't have enough mileage for a mileage sig. I mean, there's no team select sigs this week. I have a prime pack, but like. In the land of, like, things we normally like to do on this channel, we don't really have a lot of them to do today. So, anyway, we're just going to do a lot of packs today. We do have the SIG combo, which, I mean, I'll, I'll do it right off the bat here. Just, you know, get it out of the way. So that way we've got it right at the beginning of the video. Um, I totally forgot that that Harper we got last week was, like, our our, um, our SIG. Like, from the mileage SIG. And, um, let's see what I got here. Um, uh, where am I going here? I, what's the fastest way to do this? I thought I had two other SIGs. I think they were both pitchers. Yeah, because we have the Jansen. And, um, who's the other one? I thought I had one more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kyle Hendricks. Speaking of SIGs, um, I was watching, like, AK's video because I'm, I'm a bad person. And I mentioned this, like, a couple weeks ago. I was like, man, we were talking about team sled SIGs. And I was like, man, dude, like... You know, Kershaw, you know, man, you must be uh, feeling nervous about that Kershaw. Turns out he pulled the Kershaw. Look, I'm sorry. I have nothing to do with it. I apologize. Look, it's just, all right? I'm sorry. Don't blame me, okay? Everyone's everyone's screaming at me. You know, I'm surprised I'm not timed out from the chat yet, but I probably am now. But anyway, so hopefully his uh, team's like sick will go a little better. Hopefully we get a Yankee sick out of this. Please, I'm begging you, like... I'm just, I'm I'm dying here, man. Please, something. <laughs> All right, sorry. I am sorry. All I can do is pull cards. I are you serious right now? I don't need this, but it's not a dupe. Man, dude, this account is like ridiculous. Oh my god, are you serious right now? We pulled a team, a non team. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm never using it, but that's pretty funny. <laughs> like, I'm sorry, that's that's really funny. All right, anyway, <laughs> like he's never making my lineup. There's no way. I already have a better second baseman, and like, there's nowhere else for me to put him. Like, the the very next car, like, there's nowhere for him to go. <laughs> it's like there's nowhere. Maybe I can. Put him in for Posada to just, like, tank the, like, you know. Oh, my goodness. I'm just, that. It didn't register to me that that was a Yankee at first because I couldn't see the logo. I couldn't see the logo up here in this corner. Like, I can't see that. It blends right in. And then I noticed it said Richardson, and I'm like, oh, no way, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. Anyway, that's that's great. Um, Man, if only it could have been a first base sig, but, again, I pull a non-dupe. It's been a very long time, though. I'm telling you, it's been a, at least a year since I've pulled a Team Sig from a free signature anything. So that's incredible. Um, so I'm still waiting for another Diamond Sig to combine the other Diamond Sigs with that are in my lineup here. I believe they're over here. Still waiting for another Diamond Sig. I mean, I've been crazy lucky to pull those anyway, so... That's, that's why those are there. Let us proceed to... Uh, uh, let's see. I'm really gonna go get some packs open here, and then we'll get things rolling. Um, I still don't have the team select prime yet. I'm still trying to fight my way through clutch hits mode. I don't want to play clutch hits mode. I hate clutch hits mode. Um, 
it takes forever. Uh, I'd rather not, but I know that I'm going to have to do it. I am just really, really regretting it right now, okay? I'm sorry. I'm really not happy about it. It's so bad. I just wish I didn't have to do it for this event, you know? Like, I did it... I, I The worst, I think, was... I believe there was one event where it was, like, the big green wall of, like, bars. We had to play a certain number of game modes a certain number of times. I don't remember if I had to do it for that game mode, too, but... Man, I just despise playing clutch hits mode. The old one was worse, but this one's, I guess, a little better because... I mean, oh, there's a vintage. Nice. But I guess, like, right now it's not as bad because the games finish a little faster. Like, they don't... they don't have, You don't have to wait 36 hours for the game to finish, pretty much. So, I guess it's better, but... Eh, semantics. Okay. So, let's go throw all this... Um, that, that Richardson's gonna troll me, dude. I'm so... Um, like, it's cool I got a non-dupe, but I'm I'm so tired of pulling cards I don't need. Like, I've finally gotten to that point now where I'm pulling cards and I'm just like, wow, I didn't need that card. Oh, well, you know, it's like, ah, but at least it was free. That's that's the good part. Nope, I gotta go to spec training. Nope. Um, stupid. Do nods is what we call it. What is going on here? My phone has a mind of its own. I didn't even press that button. So... Hopefully, we'll be able to get him into the lineup and then get him some skills very soon. Right now, I am currently plotting the next move after him. Like, we've been messing around with Dylan Batansis. You know, trying to get him legend skills, but at the same time, James Paxton lost more games last week than he won with a 2.0 ERA. So, I, I really kind of want to get him skills. So, I'm kind of in a rock and a hard place. I mean, maybe you guys can tell me what you think. I've already asked my clubmates what they thought about it. And I'm still, um, you know, collecting opinions and seeing what the general consensus is. Which is that I could do one of two things. One, I do two. I can do multiple things, actually. I, uh, let, me, let me change that. I could do multiple things. The, what I could do, I could use a blue ticket on stability, which I don't really want to do. Because it's a level four. Uh... Number two, I could just roll him legend skills again and go for a slow starter, fireball, or control master. Or option three is the stopgap, middle of the road. Um, probably the lowest cost would probably be to just retrain Gary to give me plus 10 fielding, probably. That would probably be the best thing. Um, but I, I, I like Gary's train. Obviously, Gary's train could be better. He could have more eye and a little less power. Right now, it's a little gaudy. He's got, like I think, 11 on the right side. So uh, I'm kind of thinking that might be a beneficial thing to do in the future, and might as well do it now. I don't know. But uh, I really like stability, and I think that's really what's really harming him. Um, but at the same rate, I also really believe that he does need something better than bullpen day. He's my five starter right now, but he lost more games than he won. So, I mean, that's also kind of when you have a two ERA, you're giving him two runs over nine innings. I expect you to win more games than you lose, giving up two runs in nine innings, but... I digress. That's that. Thanks for coming to my TED talk. But that's that's what I think. I mean, I, I think that he should be doing better than that. I think the numbers were like a little, a little misleading, if you ask me. But at the same rate, um, I I would like to get something a little bit better on him in the future, especially if it's like you know, if I'm going to fix him now, I might as well fix him and do it right. But that that's my theory on the matter. Um, I don't know what you guys think I should do. Um, obviously I still want to get skills on Edgar, I want to get skills on Batansis, I want to get better skills on Mantle and better skills on Judge, um, Gary's still not perfect, I mean, Batting Machine is pretty much useless at this point, I mean, it's an okay third, but still, I mean, I kind of wish it was, I, I could live with Charisma, I'd probably put Charisma to 8 instead of Slugger Instinct, honestly, in that situation, but I think he does fine, he finished 4th last week in home runs, which is pretty solid, I mean, it's funny, like, in Ranked, my, my numbers went Granderson 1, who doesn't even have a Legend skill. It's just that. That's how good BIU is on a BIU batter. Um, so I went, like, Granderson 1, and then it was, like, Mantle, Judge, Gary. And that was pretty much my top 5. That was my top 4. And it was a considerable drop-off down to, like, 20 fewer home runs was, like, my leadoff guy, Didi, with Car SI Pred. Um... So, I mean, he's only there really to just basically get on base for my mid-focus to activate, but that's basically where I'm at right now, and that's 
kind of what we're living with. That's kind of what we're we're moving and grooving with. Uh, obviously, the rest of the offense needs some work. Diamond. Uh, Martin Maldonado. Nice. So that's where we stand right now. I mean, I, I still need to go upgrade Edgar. It'll, I'll probably do it. I'll probably end up getting those black diamond pieces. I hope I hope I can get 30 black diamond pieces. There's Hunter Harvey again from last video. We were talking about him, and I was like, who's this dude? And uh, someone in the comment section wasn't nice enough to uh, say that they, they met Hunter Harvey. And I mean, he seems like a cool dude. I mean, that's like the dream coming true. Not even just for the fans, but for the players. That someone wants to meet you as a player. That's pretty cool. That's really awesome. I think that that's probably like a life-changing... That's the part where you realize you made it. When someone wants your autograph and someone wants to like meet you because you're a baseball player. That's pretty cool in my opinion. Okay, so... What we're going to keep working on him, that Richard said, I need to get him out of my lineup. I, it's so, it is just, it's so painful at this point, man. So painful. So, why do we have to keep doing this, man? Why do we have to keep doing this? As like, a couple years back, I made the conscious decision to use my sig change on Judge. And people were like, oh, why would why would you do that? It's it's Aaron Judge. You know, he's going to have plenty of six in the future. And, like, I guess it wasn't that crazy of an opportunity, an, a crazy of an idea back then. Because the thought process was like, okay, it's like one of the best cards for a Yankee deck, pretty much. And at that point, I already had the best starting pitcher for Yankee decks, which was Sevy 17. So I was like, okay, I mean, I, I might as well just do it. And... People were like, you're going to pull a judge anyway. And like, you're going to get one. I mean, I did, yes, I pulled an 18. But I've never pulled a 17 at this point. To this day, I've never pulled a 17. Going batter all those times. And like, to this day, I've also never gotten a Posada. Either. It's like, I don't understand. My luck is just crazy with these things. But um, I think the point of my story is, is, I really hope at some point we actually do pull a first baseman. I mean, there's three right now. And hopefully there will be a fourth one at the end of this year. But... Uh, I really hope that, that comes to a reality because I could really use a first base sig sooner or rather than later. I mean, at this point, I would prefer Voight, but I, I would honestly take either. I would take any of them. I mean, I think Rizzo's going to get a 22 sig easily at this point if he keeps this up. Um, but I'd take his 21. I would take a Tino. I would take a Voight. I would take any of them. I don't really care. Just sign me up. Like, I, I'd be down for that. But... Um, Hopefully it happens. I think the point of my story is that even though somebody may say that, you know, oh, in a lot of situations it's not good to do that, but if you really want something enough, then just do it because nothing in the game is guaranteed. Like, you can prepare all you want in the case that you get a card. You could be like, okay, well, you know, I want to keep this pitcher this way because I, I could pull, you know, this card in the future. But, like, that's never guaranteed. Like, you can... You can never pull that card. You know, don't plan on anything until it's guaranteed. Like, don't let something that you don't have affect what you're doing is what I'm saying. I guess that's what I'm trying to say here, if that makes sense. If you understand what I mean, maybe you should be here explaining it because I feel like I did a really poor job of explaining it. I think that, like, you know, don't let the prospect of pulling a card one day stop you from doing something that you think is right. And you want, because I want a judge, so I want to got it. And it worked out for me, I guess, you know. What is a great increased ticket? Don't know. Don't buy them. I think I have one diamond, right? Or do I not? Nope. Don't have any diamonds. No diamonds. Although, I'll take a Didi, who recently, I think, just went on the injured list for the Phillies. Not good. Not good for Didi. Missing Didi. Ah, oh, Heen Dog, who's also on the injured list for the Dodgers right now. That's a shame. He was he came out of the gates hot this year. Who knows? I don't. I do not think it was sustainable, but uh, it was certainly fun to watch because I've been excited over his uh, his start. And fortunately, it's just yeah. Unfortunately, hasn't gone gone well for the man. Carrasco. That Lucas Giolito looks so weird, dude. That Lucas Giolito card doesn't look right to me. It's just so strange. Man, Melanson's up in the corner. That's a bruh moment. 
I'm trying to think of what other cards look really weird that I've seen. I'm trying to think. There's like a there's another Nats card that looks really strange. I just can't remember who it is. I'm trying to, I'm trying to think. Like there's like a picture of a car of a player on a Nats uniform, and you're just like, that looks so weird compared to where he is now. It's kind of like the the pictures of Charlie Blackman, but like when he was on. When he was like no beard, Charlie Blackman, you're just like, what happened here? It looks so weird to me. But I, I guess the plan is I'm just gonna keep throwing skill changes at um, who's it? What's your face? Um, Tino, and we're gonna see if we can finally land some some. Ooh, uh, is that a prime? Ah, JJ puts. I believe I already have JJ, but I'll take the prime either way. Uh, as we inch closer to a. A prime combo, I believe. That's a pretty cool card. I think I already have him. I don't know if he's on my in my mentor. I don't know if where he is at. Let's see. I believe I already have him. I've had him for a while now. Where are you, my dudes? We got a trine in. I thought I already had him. I'm gonna bet he's in my mentor already. Cause I swear I have him. Mentor. Okay, let's see. Um, let's see. I think it might be in the prime one. No, nope, but there's Charlie Blackman though. I swear, I already had the dude. Am I like losing my mind here? Do I not know who I have anymore? There's Arietta, Davis, and Trout. Jansen, Kim, Granderson, and Wong. I guess I didn't have him. I is he in my backup? Maybe. Man, I'm I'm seriously losing my mind here. Seriously losing my mind. All right, so I got all those cards. Yep, yep, yep. Yankees. Um, because I do have primes in here. That's what's confusing me. Uh, Washington. Any Seattle Mariners? He'd be next to my Felix. Where's my Felix Hernandez prime at? I guess I don't have him. That's so weird. Also, Felix Hernandez. Who I believe is also no longer in the game. It's a classic one right there. I guess I don't have him. That's so weird. Why do I Why do I think I had him? Weird, dude. I don't remember ever getting him. Maybe it's because everybody I see in chat has him. And I just don't know. Like, I'm, I had a stroke or something. I don't know. No idea. Okay, live season. Anybody? Yankees. Lucas Litke is having a pretty good season so far. That ERA is really high. It's, he's definitely been a lot better. We've thrown him into some really trash situations. He's definitely not gotten any help. I locked him, right? I locked you. You're locked. Okay, cool. I got 16 spots left. That means I can open up 10 more. Let's open up our team select slot. I always complain about... Every week I complain about these team selects. Anderson. Give me like a Yankee Prime. Give me like an early team select Prime pack. That'd be pretty cool. Chad Green. No more Batances though. So I mean, there isn't really many Yankee players. Wow, are you now you're trolling me. Now you're trolling. You're actually trolling me now. This is a joke. This is actually a joke now. I refuse to. I am. Am I in the Matrix right now or something? Like, what is this nonsense? You give me his Sig. Then you give me his normal. Like, what are you talking about? Absolutely no way. I refuse to believe that. I would make some dumb joke and be like, there has to be a camera watching me. There is a camera watching me right now. It's my own webcam. But um, I'm obviously not recording myself opening the packs, though. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. I don't know. I don't feel like these pack openings need my face in them. Maybe that that's just me. I don't know. I feel like you guys don't come here to see my face. <laughs> I feel like that's that will not add anything to this experience, personally. I feel like that it's not, you know. I do have videos of me with a face cam on this channel. I have some old COD videos, and if anybody's ever stopped by one of my Call of Duty streams, then yes, you've seen me on the face cam. But, I don't know. I feel like there's nothing to look at other than me making just stupid expressions <laughs> with my face every time I pull a card. And it's usually, like, 
Maybe you'll see me... Okay, the only thing you'll see is when I pull a card I want is you'll see me jump around the room a little bit. Maybe the chair will fall over, but that's it. Like, that's all you're going to get. Um, Michael King, 21. I wish it was just 22. Live season team select. Ah, I got two of these. Interesting. Give me... Uh, who's having a really good year? I think I already have a Clay Holmes, 22. I like a Michael King, 22 diamond. Cole, 22... Cole, 22, he brought his ERA down today. He he went out there after throwing 105 pitches today, and he went out there again, and he gave up a game-tying home run, and everyone was sad. It was He really wanted to go out there and have an inning to cap off his day because he thought he had more in the tank and um, gave up a 355-foot home run, unfortunately. Just got him. That, ooh, that's a card I don't have. That was a prime. Wow. Pulled three primes already today? Unbelievable. I think I have... All right, we're going to do this again. We're going to play this game again. I think I do have a JV Prime already, though. Although, I think it might be the other one. I think it might be the Detroit one. Right? I I thought I had this Prime already. We're playing this game again. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> we're, we're playing the guessing game. Don't worry. I'm not going to make you guys sit through that again. We're, we're not doing it this time. All right, I'll look later because, like, my primes are all over the place right now. And I'm just a complete mess right now. It's another vintage! Yeah, they definitely modified the rates of these vintages. There is there is no way... That's, like, another vintage card? Hello? Nah, definitely not. Nah, that's that's cap. There's no way... No, what are you talking about? I mean, another two vintages? Maybe, like, the glitch that happened on the other server is finally coming to this server. But, like, in a way less cool way. Unbelievable. Look, don't let this... Don't let me pulling all these vintages distract you from the fact that Ron Guidry still does not have a SIG card, okay? Don't let that distract you from that fact. Okay? Nothing important. Would rather just get a diamond. Unfortunately, they seem to be... Oh, Johnny Lasagna. Nice. Love me some Johnny Lasagna. It's very al dente. Johnny Lasagna had a tough start to the year this year. I'm hoping he bounces back because he's his stuff is way too nasty for him to be in any extended like like he he really worked on his location. His stuff is disgusting. I mean, he's just one of one of three high velo sinker pitchers in our bullpen right now. So uh, it's just fun to watch those guys every day. I said it like a million times. It's so much fun to watch us just trot out a full bullpen five inning straight of people throwing 97 mile an hour sinkers all day long it's just so much fun to watch just this absolute filth going on in our bullpen but man incredible right brian anderson i believe uh actually we have uh, the diamond to do the normal combo to recycle the diamond potentially nice that's looking pretty good zach Littell, i remember that name yeah. Didn't even do it. Didn't even get the diamond. Give me the Marwin Gonzalez, current Yankee. Nope, current Yankee legend, Marwin Gonzalez. Oop, my screen turned off again. Come on, diamond, please. Please, diamond. Or not. Just kidding. I didn't want it anyway. That was a joke. Yeah, give me the Ty Tyler Taylor Ward. Tyler Taylor Ward? He's shredding right now. Like, he's on fire right now. He, uh, I think he won POTM. He's, uh, he's definitely, he's raking right now. He is uh, one of, other than the fantastic pitching, he's definitely one of the reasons. The Angels are a very hot team right now. Just their bats are crazy. Pitching is keeping in the game. Anthony Rizzo, 22. I'm going to keep that card in my inventory just so that way I can keep track of him, even though I don't really need to do that anymore because now you have the collection feature. Excuse me. Just going to hold on to Mr. Rizzo here. How you doing? 70, 71 base. That's a little weird. Um, that is played a little bit better than 71 base. I guess it's because he has poor, poor speed. He's not exactly a speedy boy, but um, he does steal bases. That's what's weird. He's still in a couple. And he's also got it caught a couple times, too. But that's okay. I love the aggressive base running we've been doing. Ooh, Mark Melanson. 
Man, this is taking a while. We have a lot of packs, and I'm not kidding you guys here. We have so many packs. Farming oh, another prime. This is what our fourth prime of the video. It was puts Verlander, Posada, Carl Pavano. I do. Um, this is gonna sound crazy. I think I've got a Carl Pavano already. I say this, and I'm terrified saying it, but I think I do already have a Carl Pavano. <laughs> Right? Please tell me I'm right. Man, I'm I'm losing my mind here. We're doing it. I think I already have a Carl Pavano. I don't. I have a Jones. Okay. Alright. Interesting. Okay. Like, who else did we pull today? Where we got Pavano, Verlander, puts and didn't we pull a, uh, another prime somewhere or am i just losing my mind i'm just losing my mind. okay third prime of the day i'm losing my mind help somebody send help this man is losing his mind somebody put me in a home already because i can't count to four but maybe it's because i'm so blown away by these absolutely stupid pulls we've been having today that i'm just losing my mind i could that could potentially be a thing potentially how about a fourth prime We've had a couple. We've had a couple four prime videos, I believe. Jan Gomes. That was only four silvers. Not ideal. J.P. Crawford, Matt Piatti, Brad Miller. Brad Miller, I think, got a home run against us today. Kevin Gossman twenty two. That's gonna, that's a strong card right there. That is a strong card. He finally watched his first batter today, but uh, man, he's been he's been shoving. I know everybody hates that term. Geo, Geo, yes, baby, called it. I love it. Pulled the Geo Urshela. Free diamond, baby. Free team diamond. Love to see it. Man, this this video would be pretty good. If, like with all these primes we pulled, it'd be pretty cool if we ended the video pulling a legend out of a out of a premium vintage. That'd be pretty cool. I actually got a diamond out of an ultimate this week. We got one diamond. Marcus Stroman. I think he just hit the injured list. I think he's got COVID. So hopefully he gets better soon. Uh, take a gold player pack. Open this up while I take a drink out of my drink. Open that baby up. Vlad Guerrero 20. Live season old. Give me a Yankee. Please? Nope. Nope. Diamond player selects a pack. We're going to open that up last. And then we'll, uh, that's why I thought it was a four prime video because we have the prime pack. That's why I'm that's why I'm losing my mind because we had that. I totally forgot. Okay, we're opening that up later. Don't do that now. Okay, live season diamond pack. Got that from league mode. Give me a Yankee. I love Diamond Yankees, especially if it means that I mean I can use one eventually if he has a good GI. Carlos Carrasco, off to a good start. Not bad, not bad. Okay, Diamond Player Selective Pack. Let's see. Now, last time I did this, I totally forgot I get a refresh. Although I got a Luke Voigt card here. That's not a good year, Luke Voigt. We're looking for twenty one Luke Voigt. Yeah, that's okay. Uh, we'll take uh, we'll take uh, we'll take Rich Hill. Thank you much. Okay, so we're going to hold off on that. Let's open up the Prime Pack. Let's pull our Posada because we've been screaming for this card forever and we've never gotten it. It's a silver. And that's... Oh man, I, I don't know. I don't think I have a Garakol either. So we're pulling all sorts of cards we don't have. I'm pretty sure I don't have a Garakol. I say that. Please don't... Please, someone, don't make fun of me in the comment section. <laughs> I know someone's gonna make fun of me in the comments section. Be like, bro, you have a Garrett Cole card. You've had him forever. That finishes up my Yankee. That's my Mets uh, deck one. Yep. Okay. Did I say I finished up my uh, Yankee deck too? No, nah, I've had a Yankee one forever now. Okay, so we're actually p doing pretty well right there. No. I'm trying to withdraw my money. All right. So let's go combine all these dudes. Got some good combo material, hopefully, now. 
Ooh, so many gold, so many diamonds, ready for some combos. Give me a, another prime, please. Nice, Logan Webb had a great season last year. I don't know what kind of season he's off to this year. However, I would imagine it's pretty solid. Nick Nelson, do not give me a Nick Nelson. Okay, that's, I would have preferred the diamond, but just not Nick Nelson, though. Please, no, I'm good. I have so much trauma. I'm surprised he's still in the league. Who does he play for now? I want to like, Google this. Hold on. Like, where is Nick Nelson? He's got to be in the minors somewhere. Phillies? He's, is he on the roster for the Phillies? He's 1-0 with a 4.3 ERA and 14.2 innings pitched. Yeah, it's about where he was in his first season. It's just last year was just so gaudy where he just basically got put into... Every situation, it felt like he gave up a run last year. Please give me a diamond. That's all I want. Please, diamond. Give. No. Okay. Gavin Sheets. Thought he's hurt. Come on, baby. Give me that. There's Lucas Giolito again. Staring at me with that, that weird face. Looks so unnatural, man. Looks so wrong. Just, Ah. I'll take a Chapman Diamond. Or not. Uh, I guess the answer was not what I wanted. I don't know, don't think this G or Shell is useful for me. I'm pretty sure he's a, like not. Yeah, 64 base. Yeah. He'll be a, he'll be combo material one day. Let's go do our vintages and then we'll get on with skill changes. Vintages, where you at, baby? Okay, basic vintage. Give me silver. You know you want to. Okay, Bud Harrelson. Premium vintages, please. It's been so long since we've seen a legend. I would love to finally pull a legend. I'm begging you, three golds. Please. No, man, dude. What are legends? They must be a myth. Okay, let's see what we got in terms of combo material with our... Our vintages, I don't care. I'm just getting rid of this cursed this cursed guy. Let's open up all of our locked players. I'm saving the Ruth. I don't need the the Allen card. I, do I have silvers too? Oh man, we still have more. We've been holding off on these because we didn't have enough stars in the past, but now now we're looking better in terms of the star count. Um, Ruth, I can, that can go away. I don't do not need a Red Sox vintage. Um, do I have three diamond vintages? Do I? I don't, don't think I do. I've got the blue Sambito, and then I have no more. Right? No. Don't think so. All right, so let's go combine these dudes and let's see what we get. Maybe we'll get a legend off the combo finally. I mean, I don't know. Do I have three silvers for a combo? I do. Another gold. Man, that's crazy. No. Yeah. Give me a diamond. Yes, diamond. Wow. Okay, let's go do our diamond combo too now. I was kind of hoping it would give me a diamond because I want to I wanna shuffle these diamonds around. Give me a diamond legend, please. Give me a diamond legend off a three diamond combo, baby. Come on, give it to me. Diamond Legend. No, Don DiMaggio. Come on. you. I know you want to give me a legend. I know you do. Oh, my goodness. Legends. Never matter. All right. I think that's going to be everything in terms of the vintages. I don't have any more. I don't think. Lock the DiMaggio. What do you get? Nothing interesting. Shame. Because I'm not going to really get rid of the Ruth. He's just kind of there for like... In case I ever want to use him as a bench piece, I guess. You know, whatever. He'll just kind of sit around. Which is not that bad. I mean, it's a good bench piece to have, for sure. Especially for my deck. Alright, so we're saving the we're saving the premium vintage... Premium vintage... Premium skill change tickets. And uh, we're going to go skill change Tino. And then that should be everything from the video today. Man, we pulled a lot of primes... Telling you, man, we haven't pulled this many primes in a long time. Also, you guys, don't forget to do your pick 'em for your uh, pack.
power ranking. So, <laughs> I, I didn't want to tell everybody who I pulled, who I picked, because everyone was picking the other dude. Every, like, no one's been picking Wohi for some reason. Like, he's number one of the power ranking, and everyone's picking the Yankee deck, which is technically a higher overall, but I think Wohi has way better skills than him. So that's why I, I didn't want to say anything, because I felt like I was like, Man, I, I kind of got a sneaky one here, but now everyone seems to have wisened up and is now picking Wohi for to this round. So now I don't feel as bad um, talking about it. So that's who I picked because obviously he's number one power ranking. Like he's there for a reason. It's not because he refreshes a ton. He just has a really good team, and like his team wins baseball games. His skills are nuts. I mean, like go look at his skills. I was like, how do you not win with this deck? It's crazy. So that's why I picked him. So um, that's my reasoning behind that, and uh, hopefully that makes sense, and hopefully I don't lose out on my first pick here. <laughs> you know? Let's see how he goes. Maybe 5 to a player, triple, triple golds, all level 1. Triple silver, triple bronzes now. No, uh, not quite. Seeing some good levels. Just not seeing the skills I want. More triple silvers, bleh. Triple Silvers again? Oh, almost. Laser Beam on a first baseman. Charisma Heavy Hitter. Training Junkie. Close. I would take either one of those Silvers as a third, but not as a... Not two. Ace, Ace Killer. Pred Spotlight. No, I'm not dealing with Ace Killer. Pred Spotlight, not bad, but I need a... Need maybe, like, Charisma in there. Still not... Still not that ideal. Of course, Triple Three is... Star Grinsting Professional, nope. We have been rolling skills on Tino forever, man. And it may all come to a crashing halt if I ever pull uh, a first base sig. Man. Charisma. Charisma and nothing else. Okay, last one. Come on. Alright, well... It was not meant to be this week again for the 87 millionth time. No triple skills for the guy. But, uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it for me for today. I'm going to go through my lineup and see if I can figure out uh, what card and, you know, figure out my dupe situation because I may have dupes in there and I just need to know. But anyway, crazy day. Can't believe I pulled another non-dupe from a sig pack um everyone's mad i'm sorry i don't mean to let you guys down um but anyway tune in next week to see that we're going to go take our legend of bd hopefully i'll have enough pieces with that being said i'll see you guys in the next video have a good day good luck with your polls and peace